Hey everybody exploring YouTube right now. Thank you so much for taking a few minutes to check out our vertical hydroponics garden. First component you're looking at is a VivoSun 480 GPH submersible pump. Found it on Amazon for around $15. Very efficient pump. On the ground there on my cracked garage floor is a three quarter inch food grade tubing also on Amazon. It's about $18. Moving on to the lumber and the polymer gutters there. They're just sections, about four foot section. The lumber total, I think we bought four um, pieces of two by four and made this stand. And then the polymer gutters, as you can see, that was one 16 foot that I cut in just a few sections. Gatorade bottles, compliments of my son. I just would wait till he was finished and I would cut off the ends for the ins and outs. That's a big saving of about $35 on those. You'll see those online. You use an incredible amount of silicon, but it's still a lot cheaper. Um, to use just something like a Gatorade top. It's really sealed pretty well. Taking a close look, and then it's fully assembled. It's been up for a couple weeks now. Plants are doing remarkably well. A little bit of algae in the tube, nothing, a little bit of hydrogen peroxide can't mitigate. Strawberries are doing good. Some tomatoes, cucumbers. Taking a look at that bucket underneath, it's about an 18 gallon bucket. That was just you know, something we had around so I didn't have to purchase that. Water's all recycling in there, something you might want to consider. Obviously, you're going to need liquid nitrogen or liquid food. I found a combination A and B pack online for $24.99. These pods that originally came as we were setting up, the bottoms are going to need to be removed, which you can just do with an X-Acto knife or a pocket knife, I suppose. Very thin plastic, so it breaks very easily. Roots are gonna need a lot of room to grow, so be sure to remove those before you try to set them into your gutters. The holes that were cut out were cut with a two inch attachment for any common drill that you might have around the house. They're kind of difficult to get through the plastic originally, but once you figure it out, it punches right through. The foam inserts also available on Amazon. Yes, that is duct tape that you're seeing there. One of the things I noticed, the pressure and water flow was so uh, strong actually with this vivo sun that i had to initially uh, tape down some of those pods so they wouldn't keep popping out so all in all i only spent about 175 dollars to have that successful vertical hydroponics garden and you can do the same thanks again for stopping by the 614 life and if you haven't liked or subscribed yet i'd appreciate that as we try to grow this channel